Hello everyone, this is my video submission for CS50 final project. So let's get started with it. Uh, this project is an educational website kind of a platform like Coursera, edX, something like that, but it is mostly focused on uh, students and teachers for the day-to-day -day work in their colleges or schools. So teachers can post their courses, their lectures, their notes, their assignments, and students can view them, submit their assignments, teachers can keep track of their assignments, create them, so on and so forth. So let me just give you a demonstration of the website. So this is the landing page of the website. When you aren't logged in, You can just click on login so you can even register to the website you would register as a student but if you have the admin access then you can probably uh, you will you can register yourself as of teaching faculties but before we get into that let's just first log in as someone um let's just log in as faculty first let's say kelly but that's it. So currently, as you can see, uh, we are on the Kelly's, uh, Ms. Kelly's dashboard. Um, so it says she's a faculty over here. Uh, she's teaching seven courses, out of, which I, out of which two are done. So the done courses are with a gray background. You can see a gray card. Um, she's teaching seven courses to four students. So yeah, four students, for example, CS50. Uh, w, so if she clicks on teach, she can see that uh, there are the following lectures, HTML, CSS, Python, and all that, final assignments, uh, all the assignments that they have to do, like clicking on the, sorry, clicking on that, uh, you have to be taken to the lecture, um, I just give you the title, date of the lecture, and the, some description, the video lecture, and you can edit it, but Right now it's uh, completely there, so I don't want to do it. Um, let's go back to the dashboard, for example. So yeah, um, she can add assignments. I'll demonstrate that later. Um, she can see the projects, and right now only one of the four students, I guess, has submitted. So if you click on this, it is supposed to take you to the assignment, but at the moment uh, it. Uh, it's supposed to give you, uh, it's supposed to open a Google Drive link, but right now if I click all of the assignments, I just set to this random PDF because dummy data. Um, let's go back to the dashboard so she can create a course. Let me just create a new course. New The new course has been added, as you can see, but right now, no progress. It's basically a new course. Nothing has been there. So just the faculty, you no know, students have yet been registered to the course. Uh, there aren't any lectures, there aren't any assignments. So if I just click on assignment, um, Yeah, and you can delete the uh, delete the assignment if you want. So let me just delete this and my assignment one has been done. I'll add a lecture. Um, I should have copied an embedded link before. Let's just go back. Um, yeah. So back to the dashboard, new course. Let me just add a lecture. Lecture, lecture has been added. Uh, it's not yet been done because today is 16th and the lecture is on 19th. So technically the lecture date hasn't been done, but if I, for example, go and add lecture. So like if the lecture has been complete, like if the date is before, you can see the difference. Also, you can see the progress, like 50% of the lectures have been done because today is 16th, one was for 15th and one was for 19th. So that's uh, that's basically it for the for the perspective of a teacher. So let's just log out. And yeah, Tom has been like uh, he has completed one course. You can view the progress. So yeah, he has finished all the lectures have been done. He has submitted all the assignments. So if the assignments are done, it will be shown in blue. 
it's not great let me just give an example yeah like for example this uh the first four assignments have been submitted and not the four done and three are yet to be done so basically the progress has also been shown you can see the progress here as well um let's just submit an assignment first um, so as you can see the google drive link but right now i don't have one so let me just give this as a url submit once it has been submitted you can see submitted and you can go back dashboard new progress yeah the fourth assignment has been completed like third it has been submitted so there's that you can view all the courses that are available over here so for example i think he's registered to most of them so yeah he's registered you can see even if, if he's registered uh, you can see the register pops up over here and a bit of the detail about the course all the lectures the assignments that he would have to do the course has been added so basically that's it so the user can add courses the faculty can see what the assignments they have done evaluate them rate them um uh, uh, we also have login uh, log out different kinds of user have been managed in this uh, uh project so that would be it for my project video thank you